Hello, Sean McNulty here, head coach of track and field here at Transylvania University. Hi, my name is Jacob Burnham and I'm a junior on the men's track and field team here at Transylvania. Uh, hi, I'm Grayson Bray. I'm a sophomore and I'm a member of the track and field team. Hi, I'm Mallory Edwards. I'm a sophomore on the track and field team and I run the 5K and the 1500. Hey, I'm Kaylee Nolan. I'm a senior on the women's track and field team. Yeah, definitely. I think uh, being able to be resilient, um, I think being able to, again, come together as a family. Uh, the biggest thing for us we always talk about is when a team becomes a family, the sacrifices are no longer sacrifices, just something that you get done together. And I think that they've definitely taken on that kind of culture and, and mentality that you can do anything as a, as a family. Uh, through that, they, we've definitely seen success in terms of not only individual, but as a team, uh, having some of the highest marks for cross country season um, that we had this fall. And then certainly looking forward to uh, the indoor and outdoor season to, to replicate that, as well as uh, kind of succeed it. So definitely looking forward to some top performances. I think we had some uh, unfinished business from last season across the board because uh, when Sean came to the team, uh, we were prepared to take that next step forward and uh, he was more than committed to getting to know us and knowing what makes us click. So when we started to see some of those things work last winter, it was uh, disappointing not to be able to see those peaks. So coming into this season, I think we were more hungry than ever and uh, we could see that fight in Sean's eyes as well. So he expected a lot of us and uh, we were expecting a lot out of our training as well, and I think uh, neither neither side was disappointed this season. I know that um, Coach McNulty taught me a lot about being confident within myself and within my abilities as an athlete. I know in high school I was not super confident in that, um, but also just to trust the process and to take every day, day by day, and give it 110%. And I know that um, when if I do that, then I will be successful. Transy definitely is a tight-knit community, so getting to, to work together with not only our coaching staff, the athletes, but as well as professors and kind of support staff certainly goes a long way in terms of being an overall success as a program. Every time I step out on that track, it's just a great feeling to uh, know all the great things I've accomplished there at Transy's meet and in practice, and uh, all the things that'll hopefully still be uh, giving to me this season is a training ground. I love it. I think it is um, a really nice arena, really nice stadium. Um, I think that it, um, as being able to race on it a lot in this cross country season, it feels like, you know, it feels like a night, like a big stadium that you would want to go and compete at. And it, you know, has that atmosphere, even though we did those like virtual kind of events, it still, you know, has the bright lights and has all of those different aspects that make track and field so special. Yeah, so one of the best parts about the stadium for me is that the track and field events are together. You know, at a lot of D3 schools, you have the track over here, you have the throwing cages a mile down the road, and that kind of contributes to the atmosphere as a team. You know, like we're all there at the field together, and we're able to encourage each other. You know, like I'll be running, and then I'll see my teammate throwing in the cages, so I can like yell an encouraging word to her. And um, I think that really makes it, I think that makes practices a lot more enjoyable because you're there with your teammates. And obviously the view at the stadium is extremely beautiful. I mean, when the sun sets every day at practice, you can't beat it, it's awesome. That's been the biggest thing for us, make a team become a family. Through that, I think, you know, kind of just instilling the, the fact that we here at Transylvania can be very, very good in terms of distance running, sprinting, throws as a full track and uh, field program. So we definitely uh, are instilling the, the confidence that, you know, when you step on the line and you get to represent Transy that, that you can be as good as you want. And again, you know, having the, the brothers and sisters there in practice as well as competitions to, to bring you up has definitely been an a underlying uh, factor for our culture and I think it's gone a long way so far. Uh, knowing that we're not going to just be doing great things this season, these things we're doing this season are going to be things that people remember way down the road as well. He definitely has a good knowledge base. He definitely knows what he's talking about. He goes out there and he knows what he's doing and how to really push us individually and as a team. Um, and he's always very good about being personalized. If one of us isn't feeling good, he's always happy to cut it back for us or change it up for us. And he's always willing to compromise to make us feel better throughout the workout just to keep us healthy and strong and going. 
I think that he has shaped it into being a very serious program to where um, we all want to work hard and that's why we're there, but also keeping it fun and keeping it light and trying to make sure that we are enjoying every day and we um, are, and that will make us better in the long run. Be sure to follow the track and field program at transysports.com.